Vancouver Point Grey. Madam Speaker, uh, one of the unique communities in Vancouver Point Grey is the collection of neighbourhoods located on the peninsula at the University of British Columbia. Not part of the city of Vancouver, these neighbourhoods are governed directly by the province. To, to deliver basic services, the province established the University Neighbourhood Association as well as an advisory committee for the university endowment lands. While the University Neighbourhood Association, or UNA, started as an administrative vehicle of convenience, it's grown into a vibrant and effective community building and advocacy group thanks to the efforts of their volunteer board and countless neighbourhood volunteers. According to the UNA, the members of the association volunteer over 2,000 hours every year to the community. And with a quick glance at the website of the UNA, you'll see the fruits of their labours. Cycling resource clinics, family fun days, volunteer workshops, garden parties, midsummer markets, the list is endless. I attended this year's volunteer run and coordinated Canada Day celebration organized by the UNA. It was clear to everyone there that the UNA and their volunteers are the core of a vibrant community spirit in and around the University of British Columbia. All is not perfect for the UNA. They have to work hard to be properly consulted on roads and traffic in their neighbourhood to ensure safety for school children. They have a significant community mandate but no officially recognised role in planning. And despite a community understanding of the need to increase the role of what is still just a society, they have been told that no governance reform will take place until they reach consensus among the 8,000 residents they serve. Despite these challenges, the UNA has matured to become an essential part of the community fabric. Few would want to imagine life in UBC's neighbourhoods without them. Please join me in thanking the board members of the UNA, Richard Alexander, Thomas Beyer, Erica Frank, Charles Menzies, Ian Burgess, Nancy Knight, and Caroline Wong, as well as their community volunteers for their efforts to fulfill a provincial responsibility, but to do so in a way that builds their community and makes it better every day. Thank you, member.